I can play anybody. It doesn't matter. Doug, Doug got, he'll get his comeuppance. Go down and go. Wait a minute, I need a rook. Okay, there. Big C, it's time to die. You should uh, tell God I, that I said hi. Uh, no, Dougie Wuggy Doo No, I think not. I think you've been uh, spoiled. What? 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 Okay, we can do we can do that. What? Hold on. Okay. Okay, I guess I guess you know what you're doing. Not bad, considering there's only 32 on the board. It's a thing. All right, I go here. Really? Oh yeah, absolutely. Really? Really. Okay. Really. Okay. Maybe I missed something. If it looks too simple and he did it, there's something going on. Kai Burger! Oh my gosh, it's Stretch. What happened? So you went yesterday? Daddy. It's been a while. Yeah, I guess. How you been? What's going on? Same old? 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 Touch. What happened? Uh, I meant to put my queen there, not my. Oh, you did the right thing. You did the right thing. Yeah. Don't worry about it. That's all right. That was about as stupid as it gets. That's okay. We don't expect much. I know. I know. Try it again. Try it again. I, I, will. I think. I'll try it again. Because I don't think you're really getting the full bon, bon vivant oh, really. of it. You know, I don't think you're really getting that. Stupid. I had a what? What happened? Force me if I just put the queen there. So the bishop. I don't know what I'm oh, thinking. what were you thinking? So 
was not thinking. Oh, you weren't thinking? I'm not thinking. I can do it. Don't do it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Not thinking. It's done. It's done. Now stop. I thought it was a got I told you, you heal, Billy. I told you. Don't do it. It's done. Stop it now. Stop it now. I said you stop it now. All right, I don't know. Let's try this. Everybody, let's go. Everybody. Everybody, let's go. Where you going? Oh, my God. That's right. You saw it. Look at this. It gets better. That's true. Mm -hmm. All right, let me out of here. Good idea. I mean, I gotta go. Time, time to evacuate. I gotta evacuate. Let me out of here. Where'd he go? There? Taken. Yeah. Taking well, something? Okay. Okay. Let me go over here. Now we'll take something. What? You got thuggulated. I got thuggulated. I'm taking this rook. I don't care. I don't care what happens. I don't care. Man, I played like crap and you still got destroyed. I crap and I should have killed you. You didn't. I should have. I had a, I, if I, had a, I don't know what, my hands were not doing what my brain Coordinated, was yeah. yeah. Brain, you had a brain? Yeah. Okay. Hey guys, Brian here and a beautiful finish by Thug Doug here, man. King B6 and now we have the check and this is where the position ended and Carl just took here for fun <laughs> even though, yeah, I mean, Queen's gonna take the king but Carl saw that it doesn't matter where the king goes here or here, the, the king will get mated Let's say here, I mean, just the queen here. And same thing with the king over here, yeah. But super nice finish by Doug in this super unorthodox game. I mean, even from the get-go on move 7, everyone was screaming here, why, Doug, did you play queen g4 when you are setting yourself up for a discovered check on the king? I mean, look at this. Queen takes pawn. That takes some balls to play. Discovered check. And now you lose your forfeit, your right to castle. And a couple of moves later, I mean, Doug is like, just go ahead, take my um, take my rook. I got something in store for you with this bishop. And, whew, this is a very unorthodox gameplay by Thug Doug. And I think that's what you got to do when playing Carlini. Because if you play book against Carl, I mean, any disadvantage that you may have dissipates. Carl just has way too much experience. So playing spicy positions like this kind of evens the playing field in a weird way. So nicely done, Thug Doug, man. And we're going to go over in the analysis where the win was. How could have Carl close a deal? It's very, very hard to see, as well as miss mates for, uh, for White, for Doug, as well as um, a mate that he thought was there, but it wasn't there. So a lot of stuff, a lot of good stuff incoming. So strap in. 
and Kauf just pitched and logged in. There is a new behind the scenes video for you guys. If you guys were wondering what the layout looks like of where we're playing, as well as you're gonna see a brand new player and one player that you may that may look familiar if you've been with the channel for a while. It's the return of a former player, so definitely check it out. I think you guys will enjoy it. Link is in the video description. All right, let's go here in this position and in the game we have B5. Let's go move back. Pause video. What will be another move for White here? Yes, white has the checkmate with queen f6, and now mate is unavoidable. You can only delay it by sacking all your pieces, but some of you may have uh, deja vu in the sense that didn't Doug say that he misplayed something, and it was a couple of moves later, he played bishop f6, and he said that oh, if he just moved to here, it would have been mate, but what's the difference here? Yes, black has queen d8, and now this could be one continuation. I mean... So the difference was going back here, it was that this bishop was disconnecting the rook from um, having access to the back ranks. So that's why the mate was possible here, but not a couple moves later here. So just a little subtle detail there. But um, but yeah, the mate was there. Ooh, that would have been a nasty mate. Uh, but let's figure out how Carl could have closed the deal here. In the game, we had a queen takes b2, and we saw what happened. Rook protected by the bishop, tempoing the queen, and... Um, we had the queen kind of coming in here, so let's go move back here. It went from negative 9.1 to negative 1.3, so big big drop. What would be another move for black? Yes, f6, and you're forking the king, the queen, and the bishop. And the idea is you want to, obviously, you're not going to take with the queen. You're going to take with the bishop, but remember, this bishop was protecting here. So now the queen can come in for the check, and um, this could be one continuation Queen check, queen check, and uh, rook takes, queen takes, check, and um, yeah, the check here, and this looks like a free rook, but it's not because of, yes, knight f5 check, and queen takes queen, ooh, that is nasty, so, so yeah, that that's a hard line to see, because you had to have uh, saw that, um, and figured out a way to deflect that bishop, but whew, it was there. And I want to show you guys one other thing here. In the game, we had a queen f6. Will be another move for white here. Yes, Doug had it. He played it a little bit later, but queen take or I'm sorry, rook takes knight was here because if pawn takes, then bishop check crisscross mate queen protecting the, the bishop. And look at that, man. That is uh, that is beautiful. So. Uh, one little subtle missed tactic there, but oh man, that, that was a crazy, crazy game. And last but not least, um, the point of no return was here, the queen check, and we saw what happened again with the rook back. And so going back here, it went from 0 to 5.7, will be another move for black here. Yes, check with the rook instead first, and now the rook can't go back here because, um, uh, White has, or I'm sorry, black has two on it. Only defended once, so king g3. This could be one continuation, and the game is is um, dead even here. But whew, but it is a spicy, spicy game that that Doug played, and just wow from the get go, just making some ballsy moves, man, and it paid off. And I'm telling you. Uh, playing unorthodox positions against a really good player like Carlini is, is a, in a weird way, can be uh, leveling the advantage field in your favor, even though you'll be in an orthodox positions as well, man, just because Carlini is so good with the standard stuff. So, nasty done, Thug Doug, man. He is a thug on the chessboard. Good fight, Carl. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought of the game in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification, and thanks. I'll see you guys tomorrow.